Good medical morning. This is Watson, and today we're taking another step to destigmatize medical and dermatology conditions. So let's look at five medical conditions that are more normal than you think. Number five is cystic acne. Let's face it, pimples affect everyone. In fact, an estimated 80% of people between 11 and 30 years of age experience acne at some point. Cystic acne, sometimes called nodulocystic acne, is the most severe form of acne vulgaris. Deep inflamed breakouts develop on the face and or other areas of the body. The blemishes themselves can become large, some may measure up to several centimeters across. It may be uncomfortable and unsightly, but acne isn't really dangerous. In regards to acne, acne cysts are the most serious kind of acne blemish. They feel like soft, fluid-filled lumps under the skin's surface. Acne cysts are painful, but they pose no danger to anyone but your charming good looks. Click like if you support the idea that we need to destigmatize acne. Number 4. Fatty Tumors and Lipomas In fact, Google and YouTube will age-restrict most videos that even mention the word lipoma. However, they are fairly common. Here's what the Cleveland Clinic has to say about them. Lipomas are fairly common, occurring in one in every 1,000 people. People with a lipoma usually have only one, though about 20% of those affected can have several. Lipomas affect all age groups and can even be present at birth. However, they usually form in people who are between the ages of 40 and 60. Oh, and if you have an elderly dog, chances are he or she has lipomas. They aren't contagious and they usually don't harm the patient. Let's remind everyone that this is less of a concern than most people realize. Number 3. Ingrown hair. An ingrown hair occurs when a shaved or tweezed hair grows back into the skin. It can cause inflammation, pain, and tiny bumps in the area where the hair was removed. Ingrown hair is a common condition that results from hair removal. It's most prevalent in black men who shave facial hair. The thing is that ingrown hair are so common, you might have one right now and not even know about it. If you have hair, you have probably had several of these. Let's face facts and remember that they aren't that bad. Number 2. Plaque psoriasis. According to Healthline.com, plaque psoriasis is a chronic autoimmune condition. It appears on the skin in patches of thick, red, scaly skin. According to the National Institute of Arthritis and Musculoskeletal and Skin Diseases, Plaque psoriasis is the most common form of psoriasis. It affects about 6.7 million people in the United States. Do you or a loved one have this condition? If so, comment yes below. In fact, if you have any of these conditions, comment yes below and elaborate. And can psoriasis be spread? No, it cannot be spread from person to person. You can't catch it from a person affected by it, and you can't pass it to anyone else by skin-to-skin -skin contact. You can directly touch the skin affected by psoriasis and this will not increase your risk of developing psoriasis. Number one is vitiligo. Vitiligo is a condition in which white patches develop on the skin. Any location on the body can be affected and most people with vitiligo have white patches on many areas. Again, it isn't contagious and it isn't really harmful. Stick around for the end of the video as I will show you some awesome images of Amy Deanna, a model who works hard to remove the stigma from her condition. But first, let me tell you about Thinergy. Now let's hear a special word from MMA featherweight champion Felicia Spencer. She has a follow-up on Gabby's incredible weight loss with Thinergy. Congratulations, Gabby. 20 pounds is a huge accomplishment. I'm so glad that Thinergy is working out for you. It's so important to find something that works for you. You know, everybody is different. And when you find that thing, you know, just keep running with it. Uh, I hope that you're, uh, you keep reaching your goals and, you know, becoming more and more healthy. Uh, for me, you know, just finding new, new ways to keep it, keep it new and exciting is always uh, what I'm looking for. You know, some new recipes or a new, you know, a new activity, that kind of thing always uh, keeps it interesting. So uh, anyway, again, great work. Uh, keep it up. 
so why not start today? I use Synergy as a pre-workout. It helps boost my energy, so I'm ready to kick my workout into high gear. There's an Amazon link below. Pick it up with Amazon Prime today.